Langit biru siang berlabu Bunga desa So these videos that you see were created completely by AI. So you can create your own if you're interested. Uh, there are some very basic steps that we're going to take to create these videos. The first is you have to start by opening your chat GPT. Of course, it's free to log in and you can start using this is GPT 3.5. You can ask some basic prompts to generate the images first, um, which we're going to ask chat GPT. All right, so this is it. Can you give me the, uh, can you give me three basic prompts to generate the image of a Malaysian man dancing in a local dress to be imputed into Leonardo AI? Um, so be as detailed as possible. This is the prompt. Now it's going to give me the three prompts that I'm going to use to generate the image. All right, so this is the prompt number one. Prompt number two, Malay traditional Zapin dance. And then the Chinese Malaysian lion dance. And then we have the Indian Malaysian cultural fusion dance. So let's pick one of them. Let's go with the first one, the Malay traditional Zapin dance. And let's copy it. Uh, the next software, uh, the most done. Now, the next platform that we are going to use is Leonardo AI. All right. Of course, Leonardo AI is accessible by coming to app.leonardo.ai app.leonardo.ai i'll put all the links in the description so once you click it will get you here you can sign up with any of these um, details either from an apple account from a google microsoft account or you can just continue with your email and password if you already have an account before but for this let's try google now once you're logged in you will be brought in here to this very platform now you can come directly to image creation you can click on image creation and this is the place where you can create all your images. These are the images that I've created previously. And you'll be able to see the different inputs that you need to give. For example, you need to specify the model that you're going to use. Um, a series of models. Now that you've added the Flux Schnei, which is one of my favorites. I like Flux. And you can use it at any given point to, to generate. You can use any of these. But for this, we're going to select Flux Schnei. And then over here, you can have the style, the different style that you're going to use. But we're going to keep everything at default. We're going to go with dynamic. And then over here, you have to select the image dimension. I'm going to go with 16 by 9, uh, medium. The number of images, I'm going to keep it at default at 4. And then other settings, I keep everything as it is. Now, once you're OK with this, then you can come over to the top here. And then this is where you're giving your prompt that you've copied from chat GPT. A joyful Malaysian man performing the traditional zapping dance with this much detail. And once you put in everything, you can just go ahead and say generate. All right. So you can see this is very, very fantastic. You can see the image. You can see the quality. You can see the look on his face, the happiness. Everything is really, really fantastic. So you can check the second one. This is very good. And this is actually very, very nice. You can check the dressing is what I like the most and the cap, you know, it's really, really very interesting. Now to download is very easy as well. You can just click and you can come down here and you can download this very easily. You can see you've downloaded the first one. You can do the same for the second one. You can just go ahead, download the second one. And you can do the same for the third one as well. You can just download uh, just like that. So this is a con step the next step is to um, use another ai tool which is called the runway ml it's very easy also to use so that's the next step so you can come to runway ml you can just on your own come to app.runwayml.com and of course you'll be able to log in with your email and password over here as well if you have not um, signed up if you if you want to sign up you can go ahead and sign up for free with your username and password but if you if you want to use any of this, you can log in with Google, Apple, and even the we can use SSO to sign up, uh, sign up or sign in as uh, as well. But for this, let me use my Google account as, again to just log in. So once you're here, you can come down strictly here and say start a new session. You can see the tools that you have, what others have created, the videos they've created. You'll be able to see the sample of what you've, they've created, but then of, or on your own case, you can come over here. You can just click on this first one. 
to just add in the image. Now you can come over to image. You can drag and drop an image and it can give the detail of what you want it to do and it is just going to do that. Okay, so select an asset. Uh, let's go, let's say I'm going to my drive. Um, let me look at this as icons and be able to pick in the ones that I want. All right, so let's say I want this and then we can just hit on um, import it. All right, so you can see it has imported the image. Now we need to give the describe the shot. Okay, what is it? So we can still go back to chat GPT and just ask it to give us a prompt. Okay, give me a prompt to be imputed in runway ML to make the first image a video. So let's see. All right, so you can put in here the details. This is optional, but you can just go ahead and put in. And then the sizing, you can vary the sizing and the number of seconds. Let's go with 10 seconds and the model as well. Let's keep it at the highest model. And then over here, you can just come and say generate. You can always give the project a name over here. Let's say the Malaysian Zapin Dance. Uh, you can name it the Malaysian Zapin Dance if you're interested. And then the generation is pretty, pretty fast. And you can see it, it is generating very, very fast. You just give it some seconds and your image is converted to video. And this is really wonderful. Take a look. And I think this is really, really, really fantastic and wonderful. So we can just go ahead. You want to download, you can come over here. You can download as MP4 or up to 4K, but you can just go ahead and download as MP4. Now the next and final step is where you can input this and any other image that you have generated, and then you can add a background music. Now to add a background music, there is a soft, there is a platform where you can generate the music um, that can fit in this uh, Malaysian Zapin dance celebration. So let's go ahead and find that. And the site that we're going to use for this is sokesuno.com. Okay, we can generate, this is generating free AI music that is copyright free. We've done quite a lot also on how to generate um, music um, background music free of charge with this particular um, AI platform. So you can go ahead back to chat GPT. All right, can you give me a prompt to generate a sample background music of the Malaysian Zapin dance performance with Suno AI? So this is going to also give you another prompt that you can use in the um, Suno AI. So this is the prompt. We're going to just copy it directly and then we can go back to Suno AI and just paste in here very easily. And then we can check the workplace. If you want to create a new one, you can create. But for this, I want to just give it a default and go ahead and say create. All right. So this is the music. It's been created. You can play to have a preview. I think this is fantastic. So you can just go ahead and download it. We can come over here and just download. All right. So um, now that we have um, downloaded the music, we can go. The final stage now is to just assemble it and create a, a video with it. Um, we're going to use another tool, which is called CapCut. Okay, so you can download CapCut anytime. It's free and you can use it to create your video. So for this, um, I've just downloaded and installed mine. So I'm just going to open, create a project and import the video, add the audio together. So once we're here, we go ahead and create a new project. And then we're going to import our media, which is going to be the video that we have imported, um, this one, as well as the audio, which is this one. All right, so this is the media. And then once we're here, we can just import both of them and have the background music as well imported. All right, so we can just try to play. Fantastic. So we can just edit and just uh, create a cut here. 
Uh, we can just create a quote and delete this one. You can add as many videos as you can. And once you're done, you can just go ahead and click on export to Malaysian dance. You can define location here. Let's say here and say open. And then we can select video here. So you just click on export and we are going to have our video ready. All right. So let me play it. Let me play it at the end of it so you can enjoy it. All right. So this concludes this basic tutorial on how to generate videos from images um, using this AI tool. It's completely free to, to go ahead and try. But then if you need advanced features, you of course need to subscribe. But for your daily, daily usage, this is very much enough and it's completely free to use with the available tokens. I hope you enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching and see you in the next one. Bye. Langit biru sih